and welcome to trying Dutch sweets. Didn't say it because I couldn't say it. Thank you to one of the people Mummy loves most in the world, Dennis. Welcome to Mummy uh, murdering the Dutch language. So this is this. How would I pronounce this? Gemmen, yeah, something. Chocolat, fruit, Norton. <laughs> it's probably terrible. My Dutch ancestors are probably very disappointed in me. They look like. <laughs> you know what? These? You know what? Description. You try them after I read the description. <laughs> this is so terrible. Cruid no ten met en lang wit pure of milk chocolate chocolate chocolate. Mm. What do they taste like? Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Like ginger bris ginger biscuit covered in a light topping of chocolate. Can <laughs> I try this next? Sure, if you want to. I've already tried one. <laughs> the next up is this. Okay, yeah. Zuet and sal mix. Yeah. <laughs> uh, now this is kind of like salty licorice. Mm -hmm. Now, so, go for it. But it go and put it in your mouth you too. Think it's gummy or it's amplifier. No, this one's quite soft. <laughs> no, it's like... One, I don't like licorice. Two, I don't like salt on sweets. Whose idea was it to put salt on sweets? It's very different yeah. to very different to the licorice we get in England. Sweets never put salt on sweets again. They are very different to UK um, English British licorice. Not my favourite. I think Daddy will be eating all that by himself. Next up, we have this. Um, I guess that's the brand Snell yeah. Gel. <laughs> um, Cratchy. <laughs> I feel like I'm really embarrassing myself. It Cruet, Cruet, Coke, Coke. Can you water? I need to get that. Minda Suka. <laughs> okay, ginger cake to me. Have you tried some? No, I haven't tried this yet. How nice it is. Is it? Try it. Is it as bad as the licorice? <laughs> no. No way. Hmm. Tastes, it tastes like ginger cake with less sugar like than the British ginger cake. Good. Thumbs up. Elijah, thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs to the side. Next up is, <laughs> yeah, this, the originale. <laughs> okay. Uh, cute packaging. It's look Christmassy. They look like this, like little biscuits. We tried they them. Look, they look like the inside of the chocolate things. We probably what they are. They're probably the chocolate things. Oh, oh yeah. You're right. Yeah. They're, they're even called the same thing. Maybe. I don't even know what that says. Dennis did um, explain it, but I forgot it now. Don't they? They taste like the um, cinnamon biscuits you get from Lidl. Again. At Christmas. Ginger. They really love ginger. Yeah. Cin yeah. They really love their ginger. Cinnamony as well. No, they taste like ginger. They're really good. They taste like ginger Christmas biscuits. Okay. Yeah. Next, we have got this. Koeji's <laughs> Reap. <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting killing this. It's got a cow on the front. It's like a big bar of this kind of chocolate. It's very easy for you to drop it on the floor. You have it? You still have it? He's eating it. Look at us. It's yummy. <laughs> It's like Christmas chocolate. It tastes like Christmas chocolate, does it? It does taste a bit different to British chocolate. Do you think it, it tastes, I don't know, creamier? 
And dairy milk. Creamy. I guess more. Dark chocolate doesn't have any milk in it, right? Mm, not much. Yeah, more. How many it is more? Do... Nah, it's still milk chocolate. Oh no, he's getting into a philosophical connoisseur mood. It's still. <laughs> We're gonna be here forever. Moving on. Right, next up, are these biscuits. Milk, chocolate, caramel, waffles. They taste really good. They look like a wagon wheel. In fact, I forgot to show you. They look like that on the picture. Looks like a wagon wheel. Tastes a lot better than a wagon wheel. A hundred million white. Next up, we have these. And um, these are a big favourite of mine. You get these in uh, little, very similar. Not this brand or whatever. What's it? Um, what and they're so good. They look like this, but not crushed usually. These ones have been, you know, through uh, shipping and, or ML, <laughs> and even being uh, investigated at Border customs or whatever. Um, I got away from the bottom. And then marshmallow inside. Yeah. Thumbs up. I give them a thumbs up. It tastes like those marshmallow mm. things you get in England. Wait, they're a white chocolate Right, next up are these Vercade Orangey Spritz. Voren Orangey Festi. You can pause the video. If you want. You can pause the video if you want. Looks to like it. shortbread with. Like orange icing on. To do with that. Yep. Right, next we have. I'll give you a million. A million oh, yeah. Stars. What did you think? A million stars. Thumbs up. A million stars. Brilliant. Next up we have this. Now, I believe these are the kind of thing that is put in a shoe. Uh, when Sinterklaas or St Nick or whoever it is <laughs> who comes to visit I at the beginning of December. And we in got... some countries, there are, it's even, he's even called Santo Nikolai. We, we get a whole pea. We got a pea and I've broken off the bottom to try. It's pea. It's so cool. People pain. People pain. And it tastes very good. I've already tried some. Ooh. Massive, thick chocolate. Reminds me of a Yorkie. I'm trying it. But I've had a Yorkie. Mm-hmm. What do you think? Good. Good. Thumbs up. Thumbs up from me. One bad thing. Oh dear, what's the bad thing? If you eat it. I was really about all these chocolates. Is that if you eat it, you feel like you don't want any more chocolate. Do you think it's very rich? Yeah. Very rich. No. Right, next up we have these. Banana <laughs> Shum. Uh yeah anyway. <laughs> I love that word. Let go. Banana it's time. foam bananas. We have foam bananas in the UK. But these ones seem harder. Do you think? This is why it works white. Okay, it's one of mummy's favourite things. Mmm. It's the same thing, but It's nice really fresh after the top chocolate. <laughs> Re refreshing my sweet senses. <laughs> Thumbs up. Thumbs up for the foam bananas. One hundred percent lecker. I don't know what lecker means. It means good or something. I don't know. Next up, we have this tum tum mix, which really we get these in like licorice all sorts and no, not licorice all sorts. Dolly mixtures. This is like a bag of those bits in dolly mixtures. They're from the UK. They look really cool. Whoa! This Tasting! Oh, they look so cute! 
I'll show you inside. Not inside. You lost them into other ones. They're rainbow ones. Look how cute they are. And they've got like jazzles. That's what we call jazzles in the UK. What? These buttons. Next up we have this. This looks like the Netherlands answer to licorice all sorts. Um, no, the Netherlands. That looks like Harry Bow. The Dutch. Um, I don't know how to say stuff. Um, um, looks like licorice though, doesn't it? No, not well, how do we think? Well, so we say that uh, snow up mix, Let me see. mix van, suka work in drop. Snow mix. I'm sorry, Dutch snow people. Snow mix. Snow mix. Okay, so it's got stuff in it like these dolphins oh, and then licorice. I don't dummies. Wanna, I don't wanna you do gotta it. try some of the li this licorice. It might be different. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's salt on. Look. <laughs> it doesn't have salt on. Look at it. I don't think it does. Try it quick. Jude, Jude said no. Jude spat it out. No. <laughs> I do not. No. <laughs> Let me try my car. Now they're trying a dolphin from that mix. From that snow uh, snoop mix. Snoop. <laughs> I don't know. This one is another licorice one, but Jude, I think you're gonna at least love the way this one looks. Look at it. What is it? Kit Kat. It's a cat, your favorite. Yeah, even if it doesn't taste nice, I'm gonna eat it because it's a cat. Do you get the whole one? I mean, yeah. This one's really hard. Okay, what do we call this one? Cutties, drop, hard, zoet. I can't. What does zoet mean? On the bestie recipe. I don't even chew it. I'm glad that they're blurred. They've spat mm. it out. They are so cute. Oh, oh yeah, they are so cute. Look, like, yeah. Look how cute. I couldn't even chew it. So cute, they're so disgusting. <laughs> they are so Next up, we have. Is that an L? Or is it an F? Uh, low <laughs> I don't know, we've got this cruising town. West walking mall. Holland mix. West Old Holland mix. West walking. With these, I've shoved a peg over her face. With this very happy looking couple. Look at that. They must love these sweets. Right, we, there's all sorts of things in here, but we are gonna go for those lemons today when we have finished them because these are boiled sweets and they will take a while what do you think of the lemons good 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 the old holland mix next up we have <laughs> mother's day mix butter waffle teas <laughs> i'm sorry they taste like butterscotch apparently mommy don't stop filming Okay, I won't do. I'm gonna mention a few things though while she eats. This tastes really good. Now, if this is like your general thing that kids get at Christmas, obviously it's the beginning of December. Usually, kids' Christmas chocolate here, unless it's Cadbury's or like an expensive brand, tastes foul. This tastes really good. Dutch chocolate tastes a lot nicer than. No. Our stuff. Really? Apart from Cadbury's, Cadbury's is, you know, nothing can beat Cadbury's. What else was I going to say? I think these taste just like street waffles, but with a chocolate. That's fine. They're not street waffles. I know street waffles. They're he not. knows street waffles personally, apparently. Um, I do really like these guys. <laughs> I like cinnamon though. So, are the butter, butter waffles sweeties good? Yeah? Oh. I love the photos. <laughs> That's so cute. Do you love me that much? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That's kind of you to say. 
If we were Dutch, would you buy me some butter waffle sweets on Mother's Day? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, oh, only if Daddy's with us because that's the only proper way. Like, because you don't have um, any money. Thank you again, Dennis. Again? Uh, yeah, we, you said thank you at the beginning. Oh, yeah. Did you say bye? Bye! bye.